Uh, oh, I'm uh, so yeah. sorry. I'm so, <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so sorry. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. I'll come back to you. Um, uh, the difference between uh, them, how they changed, uh, obviously, it's been uh, years since I worked with them. Obviously, the maturity levels have uh, increased. Uh, the naughtiness have come down a, a little really? bit. Really? Uh, but otherwise, they are the same. Uh, I always say <laughs> Tarak, uh, I always say Tarak is like a, He's a super computer. He's like a sponge who absorbs everything, each and everything. I mean, none of us might remember what is there in this hall after we step out. But if you ask him, he will tell you the what is the color of the carpet, what is the uh, lighting pattern here, what is uh, what water uh, brand of water did we have. He remembers everything. I don't know why he puts everything, but he grabs each and everything. And he doesn't do it consciously. That also reflects in the way he approaches a character. The moment I start narrating a story to him, his characterization to him, I see his brain is already in the functioning of what he needs to do on the day of the shoot. And we are so close and I understand him so much, he understands me so much that he actually knows how I'm going to shoot the, the particular scene or shot. And I also know how he's going to act where he's going to pause, where he's going to turn his head. I know everything about him. He knows everything about me. So it is a complete joy for me when I place my camera and sit in front of the monitor and see him perform the exact way that I envisioned in my mind. So that's the kind of uh, uh, rapport that I, that I have with him. With Charan, it is uh, completely different. Um, I have been telling this many times. I, uh, the the uh, the the time when I saw uh, when I saw okay the feedback is too feedback much. can you can reduce you it a little reduce bit? the uh, level a little bit yeah yeah when I saw Rangasthalam I was I was completely blown away very frankly I after doing Magdira with him my biggest film his biggest film I never imagined Charan could be such a phenomenal actor I didn't believe that. And I was completely blown away. And I was, I was wondering how he was doing that. I didn't know that Charan. I, know, didn't, I didn't know the Charan of Rangasthalam when I did Magdira. So I was wondering how he did it. And when he came to, uh, onto the sets of RRR, it was quite a revelation for me because I never seen any actor do that. I heard about it, but I never see, I have never seen. He comes to the set as a completely white blank canvas and tells the director, you paint what you were, whatever you want uh, on me. And it is very easy to say that, just unclutter your mind, but it is, it is impossible to ask. I cannot do that. And I learned that from him. I mean, I didn't learn, but I saw that there is a person in front of my eyes who can do that. And he surprised me. He surprised me many times that if I imagined that this is what I need from the from my actor, he surpassed it. He surprised me many times. Tarak can't surprise me. I know everything about him. But <laughs> Charan surprised me sometimes. Sometimes it was not what I wanted and I had to bring him to that what I wanted uh, level. But sometimes he surprised me, gave me more than what I want. That's, that's the difference between both of them. On yeah, to your please. question, yes. please. <laughs>